Yeah. How was uh, practice today? Get back out there on the field. Man, it felt good. You know, first day coming out of fall camp, everybody out there, everybody excited. You know, good energy. Yeah. Good just keeping momentum going. How are things going for you overall? I'm just going very well. You know, finishing summer classes, you know, getting ready for my first season out here in San Antonio. So looking pretty good, feeling good, and ready to get to it. What are some things you've learned about this team and this program as you've got a few more months in here since we last talked? I really just learned the energy of the team and the soul and heart of the team. You know, it's a lot of things outside of football that really drives the team. And I think really just like taking that in and being a part of it and living it. So yeah, that's what it was. I've been learning. That's what it's been for me. How's the process of picking up the offense developed for you and your time here? Um, it's been pretty good. So I was here during the spring. So I think that definitely, you know, gave me a kickstart, gave me a little cheat code to learn everything. So, you know, now I feel very comfortable. I feel like I know the system, I made it move around a little bit. So feeling pretty good about it, my process learning. After going through the, the spring and the summer, what, what does the running back room look like? What can you say about the depth there? I will say it's definitely a lot more depth, but you know, that's a good thing. You know, you need people to be able to switch it out, rotate and stay healthy. You know, it's gonna be a long season and we want to play our way to January. So you're gonna need everybody. What stands out about Kavorian Barnes, what he brings to this team? Man, you know, he's a home run hitter. You know, I've been watching since last season, you know, when I was in the portal, you know, saying. So, you know, I really respect him a lot, you know, as a player and just as a human being. So. You know, I think he's a really good football player and I'm ready to run it with him. What do you what do you bring to the table? Can you describe your style? Is I feel like I'm an aggressive runner, but I feel like I'm also got good pace and I think I really switch it up and I feel like I'm very balanced and, and I just feel like you know the way I run. So I, I saw you had an event in the community recently. Mm -hmm. Just what's it been like, you know, getting that going and, and how did that event go for you? Uh, you're talking about the meeting group? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that was really good just to have everybody in the city come out, you know, really just understand the fan base, understand the city and connect with them. So I've been loving, I've been loving the city. You know, I love the people and I'm not ready to get started. For the city. Were you surprised to get that sort of reception? You're a new guy and they just kind of mm -hmm. just showed up for you. I, mean, I think it just really just made me, um, I was honestly flattered, you know, I was honestly flattered, but you know, I was just very grateful. You know, if I bring people out like that, just connected with the fans, then I know once I start playing, you know, be double to see them more. So I was very just appreciative of everybody in the city. Rocco, is anybody in particular a leader in the running back room or what's the dynamic like when you guys are meeting? Yes, I feel like I'm definitely Gavorian's a leader, Kedrick Cobbs, and I feel like you know, I'm starting to step up more as a leader as well as I'm learning the system. It really just, you know, any knowledge I got, I try to spread it with other dudes and everybody else, if they got knowledge, I try to spread it around that way. You know, like I said, it's going to take everybody, so everybody has to be ready at any time. Is there anything you've been able to bring from Vanderbilt that you've been able to share with your group that you think has made an impact? Yeah, definitely just some of the details. You know, I know just from playing ball for a little bit, you know, whether that's just pass blocking, whether that's just reading the defense, certain keys. Play all those names, just bring it all together in one. You know, just elevate all of our play. What made you want to transfer to UTSA? Yes, sir. Well, there's a couple of things, but you know, for, really for me, it was just a better opportunity. You know, I had success at Vanderbilt. You know, I was looking to take a bigger role, and also just a place that fits me. Just not in football, but also outside of that. And I think you've been able to see that. You know, with me in the city, and so I think that's really what led to it. Rocco, uh, one of the Spanish stations is here. What would be your message? Can you say in Spanish to all the Roadrunner fans that are excited uh, for this season? Oh uh, man, I would say, um, ven a nuestro primer partido esta temporada y, y estoy muy alegre de estar aquí en la ciudad de todos los fanáticos y todo. Y muchas gracias. Es difícil jugar esta posición. Uh, Mi posición aquí? Sí. Ah uh, no. No. Pero me encanta. Es, es muy competitivo. Vi varios jugadores en tu posición. Mm -hmm. Sí, porque hay mucha gente con talento, pero es en mi vida siento muy orgulloso mis habilidades y todo. ¿Cómo te sientes venir aquí y estar en la práctica? Es... Mm. Hoy en general. <risa> en general. Y siento gran. Me encanta el horario aquí y es no fácil, pero es suficiente con todo. Estaban diciendo de que este, los diferentes running backs, ¿me puedes decir un poquito de tu estilo? ¿Cómo jugas? Sí, mi estilo sí, o otro. Sí, tú. Sí, siento mi estilo es agresivo y tengo paciente, paciente también. Es una forma que es suave. ¿Es difícil uh, jugar en esta conferencia? ¿En esta conferencia? Uh, no sé, porque es mi primero, sí, pero uh, tengo respeto para todo y estoy listo. Perfecto. Sí, muchas gracias. You been able to hit up any of the local Mexican restaurants? You got a, fa you got a favorite? <laughs> yeah, it's uh, I like taquitos. Uh -huh. Yeah, and oh then, yeah. Um, I'm still trying to learn a few more. I know um, taquería, taquería on Jalisco. They're going to be out cut. So. Yeah. You know, if y'all know some more, let me know. I'll definitely check them out. All right, thanks, Rocco. I appreciate it.